Hello everyone, welcome back. It's another edition of Dungeons, Dragons, and Space Shuttles. I'm Cassiana and we are ready to go. I hope, I hope we're ready to go. Whew. So, a few things to work on today, slash tonight. We need energy upgrades for our tin line. If possible, it'd be nice to start on the lead line. But first thing I want to do is I want to work on seeing how many of these um, basic infusers we can upgrade to the next tier. So I'm going to gather equipment here. Uh, I think, is that everything? And that. Let's go get, I'm going to start with that and if I, if I need a change of pace we can work on the, on the upgrades after that. I will touch base and, and check on where everybody is at. So on my, on my lunch hour I did get some energy upgrades made and I made a bunch of the supplies for making energy upgrades. So, like, I got the energy upgrades put into the um, crystallizers, so their energy has now stabilized, and they are just kicking butt, throwing out crystals here, and um, throwing them down here. So, we now have 6,000 things of tin, and this has been running for, what, about, tw not quite 24 hours yet. <coughs> So that puts us right about on our sort of three day, two to three day total. Once it run, you know, it'll run overnight for a second night tonight, and it's it's it is speeding up as I get the energy upgrades in place. So we got six thousand ten. We are at fourteen eight on gold. So we're getting closer to another one on gold. Gold takes, I don't remember, 17.1. So it's actually one of the lower ones. So I'm debating finishing up the second gold one and then putting something else in line two because I am struggling to keep that one running because I keep running out of gold to process. So my thought was if I can get enough to finish the second singularity, I could swap something out for like a week. Wow, look at coppers. Coppers going to town too. Nine thousand sixty-three. I could, I mean, I could swap the gold out for like a week and do like two singularities and something else, and that would let the raw gold accumulate. That that's a thought I had. So we're at ninety-two hundred diamonds. And we're at 6,400 in emeralds. I'm curious about the diamond one. 9,200. And up here we've got... ninety-two and 6, so that's 15,3. So we got about 2,000 more diamonds before we even get our first extreme singularity. Uh, Okay, so our quest line, what we're going to work on first is going to be this one. So the Wyvern Fusion Crafting Injector. We need to upgrade eight of these in our Fusion Crafter. I have, I think, sufficient energy already saved up in here to do all eight. Um, it's just going to be a matter of making a whole bunch of Wyvern cores and Draconic cores for like the next couple of hours. So that is what we will do and then every time I get enough to do one we will craft one and then I believe I can swap them out as I go and keep crafting using them if, if I'm understanding from what I'm reading correctly. So right now to do one I only need one more draconic core which I have everything except for our lovely friends, the plates. So I just need to 
do our favorite thing of this and I have it maxed out or pretty darn close to it and uh, I have life essence on standby in the other room so we should be good to go to make a whole lot of diamonds so that is going to be our focus tonight to start is we're going to try and get all eight of those converted if we can um I'm, I'm hoping we'll have enough to do all eight i mean it's going to be a lot of draconic cores to to get them all done um because of course you have to use the draconic to make the wyvern and you need to make eight wyvern so i mean that's it's going to be a lot but we can do this i have every confidence that we can do this and then we'll just check on the ore room every once in a while and I, i'm debating do i keep the gold in there to let that one even finish up or do i pull it early and just get something else in there now running it's such a hassle to rotate between metals because you have to use your eyedropper and clean all the little bits and pieces of slurry out of there and I've just been purging it because it's just it's not worth the effort of trying to save it all um, for these little driblets here and there um, they have to basically clean the system out of the old metal and then put the new metal in to let it flow but if I did that, I know I'm pretty sure I have enough of lead, get the right one here, lead or silver to make a couple singularities worth. I could let them run, and that would give a few days for the gold to accumulate up, and then I could rotate them out again. So... That thought occurred to me when I was talking to District Spark earlier, and I'm on thinking that sounds that sounds like maybe a re-winner of an idea to maybe do that. Uh, I'm still I'm still sort of debating it in my head. As we're making, I think we're making really good progress on the, on the metallic ore singularities. It's the diamond and the emerald we're going to struggle in. I think we're just going to get to a point where we have everything but those two done. And then we're, we're going to be stuck at that point because we can't finish until we get those singularities finished and then it's going to be a matter of being patient which you know i'm not very good at being patient <laughs> uh, that's what we're just we're just have to be patient and um and just let that let that grind its way out because i don't even have a single singularity of either one of them yet and we need three so i mean that's just Ugh, you know not it's not not pleasant but I do have one slot open in the cloches that I could get a second diamond seed going upstairs in the cloches so that is that is an option we have And as we finish up the metal, start converting the cloches, I could also put a diamond seed on dirt and put like the full amount of growth accelerators below them and see if I could just generate tons that way. I don't know if a seed with 64 growth accelerators versus a cloche, I don't know. It's... I'm really, I'm really stymied at this point because I just don't know what the best option is to get mass amounts of diamond and emeralds for this. Yeah, uh, dude, what you doing in here? Dude, ain't nobody got time for that. 
dude. No, no. <coughs> Ain't nobody got time for that. And I can't see. Uh, where is my elevator? There it is. All right. All right. I have a bunch of plates now, so we're good there. And I'm gonna sleep because we need it to be daytime. How's my armor all doing? Armor's decent. I miss having mending on my armor. <laughs> oh, I don't think I have... I think I may need these for plates. I think... I have some plates there already. I miss grabbing them. And let's see, do I have any other empowered things in here? I have palace plates. I don't know why they're in there. They should probably be over here. Put you in there. Alright, so if I come here to do a draconic, there's two. Alright, so I should have enough to do the first one. So we're going to do home uh, or processing. Let us do our first of the eight. Okay, so we need regular diamonds. And I need four. One, two, three, four. That, why did I get messed up a flower essence? One, two, three, four. Okay. Then over here, I'm going to need one, two, three, four. So I'm going to do one, two, three, four. Okay, and then I'm going to use my pickaxe, which I have hidden from myself. Oh, it's right in front of my face. Good grief. Okay, I'm going to break this one in the middle very carefully. I did that very, very carefully. Okay, so now this one goes here, and it says I have everything in here. I can hit start, back up, everybody has their circles, here we go! Now what I'm going to have to do is put them in here to do the crafts and then take them down again to get the quest. So there's one. So then I should be able to put... Uh, how do I want to do this? Let's do this. We'll take carefully. Take that one out and put that one on. It still says output. We're good there. Okay, and I will put you in there. Okay, and I need another draconium block. I'm going to go ahead and just make four of them so I will have that set. Wow, I got a lot off that Enderman. Huh. Okay, let's go back to the warehouse. Okay, one down, seven to go, folks. Oh, that's full. All right. Um, I'll put you in you. And put you in there for now. And I can put you back in there. Okay, so now I need to go up and get my these. 
Now to make the second wyvern, I'm going to need four. So I'm going to need to make a total of six draconic cores for every round of these. Oh my lord. Okay. I did remember correctly that I'm going to need these plated. So I'm going to need six draconic cores, four for the wyvern core, and two for the craft. That, that's a lot. That is a lot. We can do it, though. Okay, so we're going to go to draconic core, and we already had enough to make two. Okay. The only thing we're missing now is we're missing another diamond and we're missing the heavy duty plates. So for the heavy duty plates, we're going to need the compressed bronze steel and aluminum, which I do not believe we have any of that left. No. Okay. So we are going to need to go to, we need bronze, I'll take the, that, we need aluminum, I still have plenty of that, and I need steel. Okay, so we're going to take these upstairs. I'm going to put the steel in first. Because I need four to get started. Okay. And leave the rest of those bronze while I'm thinking of it. Down, down, down. have that and I will use that on that and I will grab the fine boosting mixture which I had been making it to use on making uh, the boosting mixture for the carpenters but now I'm going to need it for the M2K so I can be making more of these plates. So we're going to take this one back here. And we're going to go here. And we're going to dump that whole thing in there. So there should be 16 in there. Okay. Then we're going to go in here. We're going to take four of you. Four of you, four of you, run around here, grab all of those, come back over here and go you, you, and you, and that goes through twice, and that gives me eight, and that is enough for four, four draconic cores right there. Now I'm going to need to do more of this. I should probably start reloading the altar now. definitely going to be a very repetitive episode because we're just going to be basically cycling back and forth between the warehouse and the crafting area to get these things done but 
we get our wyvern upgrade done man we're gonna be in great shape where did it go there it is like i know i have some more of this it's <laughs> where did it go there you go all right so now that is empty i can put those tanks up here and we'll do take these tanks and put them over here One tank, two tanks, three tanks. I'm going to put my um, crystalline tank away for now. I'll put the excess tanks away for now. And I'll put the extra thing of glowstone dust away for now. I'll put my sword away for now. I'll put the extra iron tank away for now. Put the cells away for now. I'll put that away for now. Do, 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 Should be good. Okay, so let's get another one of... Well, let me move these out of the way so I have more space. Okay. Let's do another one of these. I want to test that wyvern that I'm reading the tablet right, that I can use a wyvern infuser in a basic craft. Because otherwise I have to make more basic crafts to continue doing basic crafts, and I don't think that's how it's supposed to work. I think the wyverns are supposed to let you do wyvern and down. Otherwise you'd have to have a separate crafting area for every tier of stuff, and that doesn't seem like that's how it should be. Now, in DDSS, that would be totally how it would be. You would have to have a separate crafting area for each tier because DDSS does everything janky that way. But I don't think, I don't think Draconic Evolution works that way, so we're probably all right. Probably being the key word there. Probably. 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 And I'll probably do is get all six draconic cores made first, then make the wyvern, and then go do the craft. Is probably the process we will do is make the six draconic, make the one wyvern, that should give us enough to go do the craft, and then we'll repeat the process um, until we're done. But like I said, I think I'm going to have, I'm going to have to put all the wyverns on there, do the craft, and then take them all down again to claim the reward. Which is not ideal, but I, I think it'll be okay. I really want to see what that Dragonheart quest is after it. Because if it needs more than two Dragonhearts, that means we have to go do some more Ender Dragons. Oh, yay. I'm saying that sarcastically. Fortunately, between having the pumpkin on my head and my super mega bow of awesomeness, the Ender Dragon is relatively easy for me I say hesitantly I basically just have to stand on top of one of the pillars and shoot his little butt because my bow is just awesome that way death door is in the house hey Das, how you doing we're going to do some Draconic Crafting. We already did one. Are you working again tonight?
Okay. We don't want you missing the, the fusion crafting because, you know, it's just so awesome. Oh, drat. Hopefully you won't be terribly busy. You'll be able to lurk at least. Because I totally agree with you that we need to focus on getting this done. So I decided this is going to be our priority for tonight's episode. And... Tomorrow night in the early evening is when I um, watch District Sparks stream. And um, if anyone is, is interested, I, I should plug him more often, actually. Um, if anybody is interested in a really cool Minecraft streamer, uh, that is his address on Twitch. He streams on Friday nights, Saturday mornings and afternoons, and then Sunday mornings. And he is also playing this same pack, which he does on his Fridays and Saturdays. And then he does Chroma Technologies on Sundays. And he is totally awesome. He has a Discord server and has been absolutely fabulous to me in sharing lots of gifts. Oh, great. I'm glad you'll be able to lurk. That is so great. I still hate you. Hate you, hate you, hate you, hate you. <sighs> But um, we need to, well, we're going to have to have basically one whole episode where I'm making more of these. I'm going to have to make more of these towers. Although the, the good news, I, I, say, I say oddly, I guess. The good news, I guess, is I think we can take the brine. So it's, it's, it's the brine into the lithium towers, right? We just need to clone clone these and then clone these and clone these, right? Once I get the lithium out, I may be able to like co-mingle all my lithium maybe into some tanks and then just go to town with these. Like the entire length of the room. So I, what I may do is have the lithium come out and come into these like from each tank, and then have them co-mingle into some advanced tanks, and then literally just go to town with a whole row of them. Now there's a spider in here. That's right, it's a daytime, I don't have to worry about them. Yes! So yeah, if, if you... Dude, you're in the way of the sign. Move, 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 move. Yeah. Saturday, his, his Friday evening streams, and then his Saturday morning, he'll stream uh, U.S. Central Time. It's like 7 a.m. until like 2 to 3 p.m. Central is his long stream of the weekend. And, and he is in about the same position in the game that I am. Um, and he is totally awesome. I'm, I'm enjoying his stream immensely. He is an Australian living in Halifax, Nova Scotia, if I remember correctly. And um, I am I'm enjoying, not only I'm enjoying his community a great deal, but the people in his community are fabulous. Several of them have joined my streams and have been fabulous in offering me tips and, and advice and stuff like that. But District has played modded Minecraft for... Oh, are you Canadian too? That's awesome. Well, he's he's an artificial Canadian since he's originally Australian, but he's been living in Canada for I think he said nine years now. That sounds right. And um, but yeah, he is he is fabulous, and I I've learned so much from him. Like how to actually use this RS system and the crafting monitors and the crafting grid and the pattern grid and the crafters to use patterns to auto craft. All of that stuff I've learned from him. And it has made my game so much better. Um, like the entire reason I was able to make the uh, Wyvern solar cell or the solar panel as fast as I was able to was because I took all of those photo cells and made patterns for them and then used the auto crafting ability of the RS system to make those puppies. And that's all thanks to what I learned from District Spark. He has been just 
just awesome and he's great about answering questions on stream and, and it's just been it has just been a really really great thing to have found him now i'm out of gold are you kidding gold uh, gold gold all right we'll take this so i definitely want to give him shout outs no 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 what am i doing i'm being being silly give me that back okay i need to keep this in things that are in terms of fours so we'll do 60. So I like uh, I watched his the the uh, the replay of his stream on the mechanism um, times five for aura processing. I watched that. I lost track of how many times I watched that. I was making notes as far as how the you know how the machines are flowing together. And between his video and the wiki, it helped me put my aura times five together for the first time. And now that I've, I've, I've seen it for myself in my own world and made it, now I'm able to figure out, okay, what combination of machines do I want? What order do I want them in? What layout do I want them in? And stuff like that. So it has been, it's been so good. I found him at just the right time, too, because, we're, like I said, we're right about the same point in the game, and we're able to be helping each other, and it's just been, been so nice. And now, oh, look, we're back to our diamonds again. We almost have our, our, our draconic, draconic cores done, though, so that we can get working on the wyvern. So we are in great shape. How did you eat so much already? You are a hungry little guy, aren't you? Oh, my gosh. All right. Move these up here. I'll move that over here. I'll move that up there. And we'll do another one of these. Gotta try and get that wyvern core done fast so we can do another another uh, draconic craft before death has to go to work. I think that's the part I think I've liked best about finding him is having someone in end game at the same time and we're able to be bouncing ideas off of each other and collaborate on some things and it's been it's been so helpful especially with some of these some of these end game things because i had not done any of this stuff before it's it's you know so new to me i i had not done blood magic up to ter tier five i had not done higher level astro astral sorcery i'm not i never done draconic before this week was the first week i had ever done draconic ever and so yeah this is this has all been like exponentially all new minecraft for me it's so fun terribly exciting And I know I'm on the right path to the awakened draconian blocks that I need for my seed. Which means that that check mark for mystical agriculture, it's like right there. I just need to keep pushing for it and I'm gonna have another check mark. Those check marks get me just so fired up. I know I got a long way to go before I get the check mark for tier five. That's going to be the last one to finish the game. That's, that's got a long way to go. <laughs> and the mystical ag one, that one is that one is really close. It's it's just a matter of being able to to get to making that those blocks and then being able to do it multiple times because I need several blocks to get the seeds, and then I have to make a crux to put under the seeds. And then I have to wait for the darn things to grow. Ugh, I have to wait for the darn things to grow. Which means being patient. I am not known for being patient. I 
And apparently also not known for doing math because 10 is more than 9. Good grief. Oh, I think I have some of that upstairs too. I should go grab that. We got, we got some when we ground up some dark gems. Ah, we did. We got three. Great. That'll speed up the next one. I swear, I always miss that turn. Okay, let me move that up here. And we'll do one, two, three, four, five. We got everything. Okay. And you got everything is back to being fully charged. That's great. Boom. Get out of the way. So I, I've got in my head like several paths of I need to work on this thing, I need to work on this thing, I need to work on this thing. And it's like, which one do I do first? Which one has the higher priority? It's like, it's too many things! Some of it I'll be able to work off stream while I'm watching his stream tomorrow and then part of Saturday, although I'll be out of the house for part of Saturday, so I won't be able to, to be working. But since I leave my game on all the time, the ore processing is just going, like, constantly. It's constantly running. So as long as I have the game on and it doesn't crash, it will it'll just keep running. And can I just say... Getting my computer upgraded to 32 gig memory was like the best damn call ever. My game, I think, has only crashed twice since I did the computer upgrade on the memory. It is playing, it is operationally lights out so much better than it was before. The memory upgrade was absolutely the perfect call to get my, because I was crashing out of my streams like every other day I would have to end my streams because the game had crashed that has not happened knock on wood that has not happened once since I've had the memory upgrade so I am so glad I made that call to do that that was such the right call to go and invest in my computer like that oh I am so so glad I did that Okay, this pack is this pack is heavy duty. It my my little eight gig was just not going to cut it any longer. It just wasn't. And it was fine for like the first part of the game. And my garbage collection uh, additions to the Java area were keeping up. But the farther deeper I got into the game and the more dimensions and planets I was opening up, and I'm like, no, nah, it's it's just not cutting it. It's not keeping up. So, yeah, best, best call ever to get my computer upgraded like that because it's just, it is taboo now. Okay, there's that. Okay, we need one more Draconic Core. So we need one of you. Okay, so that's six. Now we can go make the Wyvern Core. What are we missing here? Okay, we are missing four. Oh my god, we're going to need all those diamond promise acceptors. I need to get those going now. Oh my lord. Dim I do not have any diamond blocks. Shoot, okay. We need to go to ore processing and raid the diamond blocks. Okay, let me think. How many? I've got four diamond. I have four diamond promise acceptors for this one. That means I'm going to have to make six more, six times, I need 24, oh, yo, yo, I need 24 diamond blocks, not 64, 24. Ooh. That's, ooh, okay, that's probably going to slow us down because I don't think we're going to have enough to make 24 Diamond Promise Acceptors. Ooh, 
Okay, I do not have the tritonite in there. Do I have it in here? I have a tritonite. Hmm. Okay. What do we need to make more tritonite? Tritonite is here. Here. It is cobalt and terax. So we're going to do cobalt. Take the blocks. Terax. Nothing, so I'm going to grab from you, put in you, I have 11. Okay, if I put you in you, okay, that's everything I can make right now without making more Terax. Cobalt in here for now. Okay, I'm going to need seven nether stars. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Got seven. Here we go. Wyvern. Boom. We are going to head to ore processing, going to head to the roof. Okay, so this is going to be our first test to see if this will craft with a mixture. Okay, so we have one there. One there, one there. One block there. You're already in there. And then I need do 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 four one two three four regular diamonds. One, two, three, four. Now if I come over here, I do have a start button. Start. I'm getting all my circles. We are crafting, Dads. We are crafting. Boom. just absolutely some of the coolest I think I've seen. Bink! It has little sound effects and everything. I just love it. It's just the coolest thing. Okay, so that is two. So we're very carefully going to break this one. Pick that one up and replace it with this one. And then we're going to put the one we just broke in there. Okay, two down. Six to go. How are we doing here? 6,310. 15,000 blocks of gold. Dang, copper's almost caught up to gold! You're slacking. Hurry up. <laughs> Love it. Love it. All my little parades of crystals. I love you so. Ah. All right. Back to work. Back to work. 
Two down, six to go. We now need six more draconic cores. Uh, here, we are missing, we need more plates and more diamonds. So we're going to go make more plates, which means I have to take that back. We're going to take it from here, put it in here. How much did I put in there? Uh, seven. That should be enough. Okay, so in here, we're going to do... Four steel. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Put those over there. Come over here, grab these, flip around, and do blink, blink, blink. One, two. Thank you. Eight more. How many do I have it in here now? That should leave me two. That's not enough to do another one. Got a little bit more in here. Let me go ahead and do a second round. This off here. Ten. So if I do one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Run around. Take these. Go boom, boom, boom. Okay, that's going to get me 16. That'll give me 8 draconic cores. So that'll, that'll take care of me for the next 2 before I have to come back and make more of that. Alright, now we're back to here. And get I'm stuck. They're at five. This one will go faster because I already had the ones from upstairs to give me a kickstart. Okay. Lurkdom is always welcome. Why was the chicken hurting? Which, which chicken was hurting? Oh, never mind. I'm not going to bother about the chicken. Darn chicken. Okay. Got another one done. I'm going to grab this. Put that down here. Now I'm going to rearrange my stuff again. So there's one. There's two. There's three. There's four. Head over here. They had trying to charge, so we'll do one there, one there, one there, one there, and one there. And while I'm thinking of it, let's take advantage of the processing time and stock up on some Terra Steel blocks. That's better. Okay, you 
you're still going. Let's see. I need, I've got two. I have six to go. Six times four is 24. So I can do 13. I can't count. 13. No. There. Okay. I need 24 regular diamonds for the crafts. So I can go ahead and go make more mana diamonds with these. Okay. That should give us plenty of mana diamonds that we don't have to restock those for a little bit. I swear I always miss that turn. I should probably get more of my uh, pulsating dust going. magic in it. That one. I'll switch it for this one. up on my butt. Okay. Here, 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 there's three. Okay. To do the next one, we need, surprise, surprise, we need more of the diamond plate, diamond scene plates. Alright, we'll put those in there. And I'm going to drop off that in there, and that in there, and that in there. Uh, we can put the gold and that in there for now. Do I have any more draconium? Boy, yo, yo, we're going to be out again. Balance the grid and do that. Wow, I have all of 17. <laughs> I am so out of shark It's not even funny. Seriously, not even funny. Oh, wait, I should put this away. After we finish 
this one, we should probably grab any life essence that's over there and bring it over to restock this. The Draconium Essence, if I remember correctly, does not have a crux under it, so it can be put in, or I can um, use Mystical Fertilizer on it, so we can do that, and I have a ton of Mystical Fertilizer, so that's not an issue. I could also make another seed and have one seed running here and another one in that one of those cloches over in my cloche farm. back here. One of my mystical egg areas has a couple of those growth accelerators on it. I may want to move the draconium seed to that one. So whatever little benefit they're giving, it is getting. That's another good idea. I don't remember which one it is, though. I'm going to have to go look. Okay, so there's that. We'll go do another one here. which one it is. Let's take a peek here. It's one of these on the edge. Let's see. Oh, that can't be you because you're a dragon egg. Can't be you or another star. There's nothing on it? Oh, I'm an idiot. This is the one with the growth accelerator and there's nothing planted on it at all. Oh, you are an idiot. You are an idiot. Where is... Come here. You, Katiana, are an idiot. Idiot, idiot, idiot. Okay, well, we've now fixed that. Give you some love to get going. Okay. Uh, now I have just... I cannot believe I had nothing on the one plot that has growth accelerators. Oh my gosh. I completely forgot they were there. I completely forgot they were there. And then I was just now thinking about it. And I'm like, don't I have a couple of those? I got out of loot bags that are sitting somewhere. That was, that was bad. That was very, oh dear. What's wrong now? Are you, what are you out of? You're out of that. Okay, we can take care of that. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's take this down. Okay, we've got to be creative here, and we're going to take that out. Okay. Put that there. Oh no, wait, that's the iron one. I didn't want to do that. Oh dang it. Hang on. I thought that was my tin tank. That is my iron tank. Where is my
my tin tank has something else in it at the moment. Okay, fine. I'll do this and this and that. I believe my salt is ready upstairs. I need to bring it down so I can start making this again. Okay. Got both of those. One there, one there. Take that, take that. And you run up to the roof and check on that salt. Oh, yeah, we have a bit of salt. That should start filling up now. Excellent. Good job. All right. And now we can take this piece over. that. That one is now done. again. Sleep. Somewhere around here I have got to have a spawnable place for that creeper who have gotten on the roof. again needing more of the diamond how did I get a basalt cobblestone oh my gosh I punched the roof I love my pickaxe, I really do, but good God, could it really stop every once in a while and not hurt things? Seriously. All right, we're at 
I need to go see how those diamond acceptors are doing because all of this is going to do us no good if we don't have our four diamond acceptors to do the next wyvern core. We'll take a peek at that when we go back over to do this next diamantine. We could be in a position where we can only do so many per night because then we have to wait overnight for things to restock supply-wise. Alright, let me start this. You're going. Let's check how we're doing on these. Oh, we're already up to six. Uh, unfortunately, we're out of blood, but how are you doing as far as... You still have a good supply there. Let me take some of you over here. That should give you enough to keep running. It, this was completely filled up to 640. It got six of our Diamond Promise Acceptors. So we will be able to do one more Wyvern, Wyvern Core. And then we have two towards the next one. And I don't think I have any more over here. I think I took the ones I had upstairs already. Oh, but I do have some more Draconium Essence. Well, how is it doing in there? Oh, I bet it got kicked out from in here. Nice. That's a nice surprise to have. I will take that in a heartbeat. Oh, yeah. That'll keep us going a little bit longer. Noise. All right. right. Here. Put that in there. Followed by that. We just need one more Draconic Core and we'll be ready to make another Wyvern and then we'll be ready to do our third. Like I said, our issue now may be we do not have the Diamond Promise Acceptors. Okay, so we'll do Draconic Core. We're good there. Wyvern core, we have enough to make that. We are good. Okay, we are headed off. Home or processing. Jump. Okay, 
one there, one there, one there, one there, and then I'm going to make room for my one, two, three, four normal diamonds. Let me one, two, three, four normal diamonds. And we'll we have our start button. Here we go, Death. We're doing number three. Three of eight. Remember, we need to do eight for our quest. Number three. I think this one, I think what I'll do is I'm going to take that one down. Take that one down. Oop, I missed. There you go. You need to go there. Okay, three down, five to go. Ninety-four. I'd really like to get this one done before I swapped it out. That would be really nice. Okay, home warehouse. Okay, can I do any draconic ones to start off with? No, I am missing my draconic plates. This is a problem. Have a few up here because I found that extra essence, thank goodness. So now, draconic core, yes, I can make one. Okay, so now I'm only missing the diamond. How are we doing on support here? 31. <sighs> Remember we started that? It was 101. It's already on. The, we've used seven, net 70. in here. Surprise, surprise, we're making another diamantine diamond. <laughs> it's two and a half. It's, it's 2,500 per blood glowstone. So, I mean, we're going through this stuff pretty darn quick. Depending on what happens with those um, diamond promise acceptors, it may be we can only do half of them tonight, and we have to do half of them tomorrow night, and we have to work, go back to working on ore processing, which is fine. And we're still working on things we have to work on. 
So I really wanted to get these done tonight. I did completely spaced that I needed those Diamond Promise Acceptors. Otherwise, I would have had those grinding like all week long. Ugh. Someone had mentioned in the DDSS Discord about how you need tons of them, and I had joked, oh, I should start bulk producing them now. I should have listened to myself. <laughs> now we're down to 22. Last one. Okay. Right, so there's that. I can bring that down. I can bring that down. So, story, um, somebody in, shared a picture on, on the uh, Dungeons, Dragons, and Space Shuttles Discord of some stained glass windows that they made using chisels and bits. The mod. And it is this intricate, beautiful stained glass window. I kid you not, it looks like a real stained glass window. It really does. And I, I had asked them how long it had taken them to do that. And he said, oh, about two days. Like, oh, my gosh. I'm like, yeah, I, I told my daughter would totally get immersed in that because Kumidori is so detail-oriented when it comes to her building. And so I showed her that picture. And she's like, oh, my gosh, it's so beautiful. I'm like, yep, 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 yep. And so I'm, I'm very curious to see if she starts exploring chisels and bits and what she can do with those because... I can you know seeing what she did with the mushroom house I can only imagine what sort of stuff she could get into with chisel and bits for building oh my gosh this stained glass window was absolutely incredible I mean it was just gorgeous I mean obviously this is somebody who had drawn if you will with chisels and chisel and bits as a mod many times before they knew what they were doing as far as assembling those little bits and pieces of, of, of glass oh my gosh it was just amazing absolutely amazing that creeper now has me spooked even though he can't hurt me Ugh. That. Come down here, come down here, this and this. I can make one. Okay, I'm out of these and I'm out of Edraconian plates. So let's go make some more of these first. I need five in here to be able to do it. I have exactly five. <laughs> Lovely. All right, so we're going to go in here, and we're going to do five, four of you. One, two, three, four. Four of you. 
One, two, three, four. Take you. And one, two, three. That will give me eight of these. All right, so now what do I have? Where'd my door go? No problem. Uh, I think there's a problem. There's my door's missing. What is going on here? Yeah, I know the casing is incomplete. Something took my door. My, my door's gone. <laughs> where, where did my door go? stole my door. I'm not amused. Something actually stole my door. I don't think I've got Fission reactor casing. Maybe I can make fission. Okay, good. I can make some more. I'm like so flippant confused as to what the hell happened here. Thank goodness, but holy hell! <laughs> what the? 
Okay, now that I got completely distracted, what was I doing? I got the plate sensory. Okay. And I was going to see how much of this did I have. My reactor, it was sabotaged. Sabotaged! My reactor was sabotaged! This is very upsetting. Okay, so now if I come here and I hit Draconic Core, I can do one more. Now for this one, I am missing the plate and the diamond. So let's do the diamond first. So I'm gonna need my second stack of glowstone. I mean, I suppose a zombie could have been down, somehow gotten down, been downstairs during a blood moon or something and knocked it down or so I don't know. I'm totally confused. Something sabotaging my base. That'd be bad. Hopefully we're going to have just enough to finish one more block here. Yep, we'll have just enough. That's not right. You're in there. Okay. I should see if we've got some. Oh, I see we do.
that's still nice and full. You're nice and full. You are worrying me, dude. That jacket is just weird. Almost to two full tanks. Come on, you can do it. Uh, see, we're going to stall here because we don't have any more Diamond Promise Acceptors. stock. Sleep. If I take one of these and break it back down into ingots. That may be as far as we can go tonight on this line because of the lack of diamond promise acceptors. Oops, wrong thing. And the lack of draconium. Oh, no, wait, I just had a thought. Just had a thought. Um, okay, drop that in there, drop that in there, I'll drop that in there, because the other way of getting draconium besides the seeds is with, where did I put it, the draconium dust with the volcanic ore, right? Where did I put that? Right in there. In there. I've got the dust and I've got the volcanic ore. So I want this, this. See, that gets me one. That gets me one. Oh my god. 
All that work to get the Y vermis, you can recycle it to get all of six ingots. That gives me one. Okay, that gets me four. But I'm running out of refined boosting mixture. I think I've... Big tank up there. You're now out of dark magic essence. Oh, you're also out of Naquita. How oh, good grief. Okay. So the Naquita I have like tons of. So I'm Basically, I have to process the Naquita and the Uru without boosting mixture to make boosting mixture. It's one of those, just, that's how it works. So let's take this down. Do half at a time. How are you doing here? You're good. Iron or uh, energy level seems stable there. I bet without boosting mixture, I still get two. I still get two without boosting mixture. Oh, I hate leaving those two on the table though. Especially when I'm short. I mean, that would get me, if I put that in there, a stack of each of those at two each is going to be 128, but it could be 256. I think I will hold off processing until I can get the boosting mixture to maximize my output. What I can do leave one spot for it to come in here.
I can at least get the draconic cores made. And then all I have to do is wait for the diamond promise acceptors. the wyvern cores. It's almost 20. What we can do is I think I have enough I have enough of the diamonds to do one more draconic core once these are done. I can put all the stuff related to the wyvern upgrades back in the chest and then we can change course and work on the energy upgrades instead on the ore processing line for a while. That'll give the Promise acceptors a chance to go, and also a chance for the seeds to generate some more essence. Although we can always do what we just did to make you know 20 at a time with three or four stacks of fertilizer. So this we can keep going with the fertilizer. I have no issues doing that at all. That's fine. But there's nothing I can do to speed up that promise acceptors. Those are going to be the trick. So if I go here, 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 that's five. And what am I missing here? Okay, I'm just missing two more diamond plates. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that if we can. How much do I have in here now? Got back up to 33. So that's going to be enough for us to do one more round of diamonds and we'll be able to do the draconic. Then, yeah, I think what we'll do then is we'll put all the stuff related to the wyvern upgrade in, in the chest, we'll set it aside and let those diamond promise acceptors process. And we'll work instead, we'll flip back over to our processing and see if we can finish up these energy upgrades on the iron line, not the iron line, the tin line, so that it is running at 
peak efficiency given its infrastructure. And if we can get that done, then we can start making um, line four, which would be really awesome because then if we could at least get to the crystal formation part, if we could get that much of it done tonight, so it's making crystals overnight, then tomorrow while I'm watching District's Friday night stream, I could work on making the machines that convert the crystals into ingots while I'm watching his stream. Because you guys have watched me do that now like three times. I think you probably have got the idea how to do that. You don't need to watch me necessarily do it again. Um, <laughs> Yep, we're doing good. We'll be able to get one more block and one more diamond out here. I think I think that is going to be the plan. So we're going to put the diamond, this, this, and this. there's really no need for me to rush and get more draconic ingots without the diamond promise acceptors. If I don't have those, hello, thank you. If I don't have these, I'm dead in the water. And see, those take... A hundred and sixty per. I have a source I have a source of more blood we can do that okay hang on hang on I forgot about the blood shards and do I have fluid duct and reinforced servo uh, oh you're done hang on grab you You. Let's add a fluid duct on the back. I'm going to go get this processed. We may have a way to get at least of some of these, uh, some more of these promise acceptors. I had forgotten about the blood shards. There's probably a chest full. I can move them into that, into that, um, storage drawer, bring them up to the roof and start cranking those out. Did I put the, yeah, let me grab that one back. Hang on. Where'd 
that empty one go? That holds 256. Here, here, here. Okay, we're at six. Let's put this, 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 the Uru is not. This, 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 uh, this, 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 uh, this, 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 and this. Okay. you away. I need another storage drawer. This one is full of them too. We'll take these. That one is now full. So then I'll take the rest of these. Give me this one. Okay, this one goes here. No. Why did you put both of them down? Oh, for crying out loud. I don't know why I did that. for the same reason I put a hole in the floor. Oh, yo, yo. Alright. Okay, so the iron tank is going in up here. Now this one I think that would have to would have to go in underneath. All right, we're just gonna have to do it this way then. Fortunately, they go very fast. Probably should have put the magnum crucible on an end so I could have had one of its inputs available. I could rearrange it, but I'm not going to worry about that now. This will hold 256 and it needs 160. So if I can get enough blood charts to fill this, it would do one. If I can get enough to fill it twice, 
it would do a couple and be real close to a third, right? Where's my other... Those are all stone. So my other big tank is filled with crystalline. Should be able to switch these out though. Hang on. If I put that there, I put that there. I wanted to have all the crystalline in one big giant tank to be doing the the upgrades but now I need my big giant tank to do something else it's like I can't win What I can do is I can put the 64,000 tank on here while I go take the 256 when it's full downstairs to drain into the blood infuser and I can just run the 256 and the 64 back and forth. It is inelegant but it will work. Can I store these in here? Yeah, they won't go anywhere. That'll work. That will work. Pressure won't take them because they can't be crushed. The blocks of diamonds are just sitting there in the blood infuser, and that blood infuser will just keep running. So eventually it will do it. It's just, I want them now! This is one way I can speed up the process at least a little bit. And maybe I can at least get two more to finish one more wyvern. That would get us four. And I would feel pretty satisfied at getting half of the eight done on our first session of working on this class, that's pretty good. I 
I don't know if I have enough hardened blood shards to do another four. I'm hoping I have enough to do two, because then it would allow me to do one more craft. I don't think I have enough to do then another four on top of that. And the squeezer is probably filled so it can't go any faster. We could probably add a second squeezer. Oh, there we go. All right, so this one's full. So we're gonna take this one down. Let's put that one on there and put one in there to work while we're gone. All right, here we go. All right, so we're gonna take this one, we're gonna put it on the back, and we're gonna put this on and say, go. All right. Oh, now on its own, it managed to get the third. So that means that tank has enough to do the fourth. It managed to get enough for the third while we were doing that. Excellent. Excellent. There's the third. So now I know we're going to have four. Which means we will be able to do our fourth craft for sure. That's great. So we'll get the fourth one done, then we'll let all of our supplies restock while the diamond promise acceptors are finishing. And while they're in process, that should allow for our draconian essence to restock. One would think. Okay, you're done. Let's go take this one down. That's draining pretty fast. See, because I'm thinking, yeah, the squeezer is full. It's operating just as fast as it can be. And it's working on the fourth, okay. I mean, that'd be one possibility would be adding multiple squeezers. Instead of both of these feeding into one squeezer, they could each have their own. That's our fourth. It's almost ready to go for another one. So we'll give it that one. Put 
put the iron tank back on top and off we go. in there, sleep. Pop back up here. It was just starting the next Diamond Promise Acceptor when I left downstairs. I'm glad I remembered this as an option. The setup I have downstairs, they are set to automatically feed back up into the into a magma crucible so they don't build up. They're automatically added to the blood supply that feeds into that blood uh, fluid infuser that's making um, boosting mixture, so. The leaves accumulate down there, so I have to keep remembering to bring the leaves upstairs. Still a ways from a second full tank, but... Oh, nope, you have wood. got two done. Excellent. Alright, so this is okay, so that's empty. This is the smaller tank. Take it down. Okay, 
so we have two more so that gives me six. Oh wow okay so we actually are we're closer to being able to do another one than I thought I am going to refresh my drink. I want to step away. I should be back in just a couple of minutes.
Okay, I am back. I couldn't decide if I wanted water or caffeine. I opted for caffeine. So we are back. I'm getting back under my covers because I'm cold. All right, back to the grind. Here we go. All right, boom. I mean, if we can get if we can get this tank full, combined with what the squeezer is generating, maybe we can get enough to do two more. We might. We got it full. Let's just put a stone tank on top here. stone tank on. Make sure we have that empty. We do. Okay. All right, take all that downstairs. Okay. Put that one. And we'll put that one on top. It's going to be close. Be 30. That's going to, it's going to be just a little bit short of being able to do two more. But in the time it takes us to make another round of the Draconic cores and everything, by then maybe the squeezer will have finished off that last one. That's assuming we can get enough draconic ingots. Well, we can go we can do the fertilizer method again. We'll let that go. That one's done. Let me put that away. Let's grab everything that was in here. Like all of the things. So if I go to here and now do wyvern core, I can do a wyvern core. So I can go and do craft number four. Okay, home or processing. It 
already has one in there. Put the wyvern there. One there, one there. Draconic block there. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And the things in the middle start. Halfway done. We are halfway done to having our thing upgraded. next one in for the next one and we can say we'll take that one down very carefully and that side is completely done okay let's head back to the warehouse now I need to do draconic cores again and we're missing those plates okay Did I have any boosting mixture left? No. Okay, so we need to first make boosting mixture, which means we're going to need dark dust, which means we're going to need the obsidiarite. any in here, but I will look. Oh, I did! Nice! Great, we'll work on crushing the next one while we move forward. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Okay, dark. Do I have enough to do two? I do! Great! Let's go ahead and put these back in there. I had just enough basic plating to make those to get my new, my reactor back up and running. Thank God. So stupid. Okay, we're gonna need more gold to keep going here. It looks like too. Okay, so there's that. What do we have for gold left in here? Okay, we got that, and we have that. So we'll just take all of it. And while we're working on this, we'll go and plate that. And then we'll go ahead and do this. And that. Did I have any gold plate in here? No, okay. Not a problem. Okay. So I need to trade that out for this one, and we'll put that in. What am I doing? No, 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 no. What am I? No, 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 no. That is, that is me being a doofus and, and going to the wrong machine. I want this one. Although it's nice to see there's another way of getting the blood-infused glowstone, because I am going to need that. <laughs> I'm looking at that and just going, no! Didn't I 
make two stacks of it? Did I only grab one out of the machine? I did. I was a double doofus. Smidge short because I messed up and put him in the wrong machine. Um, okay, so we'll put that one there. Cobalt we don't need quite yet, so we can put it away. We can come down here and we can grab one, two, three, four. We'll grab six of those. Where my ring of Odin is not giving me all my bonus hearts like it should. I'm just seeing my normal four bonus hearts. I'm not seeing my extra, extra bonus hearts. I just now noticed that. Here. 
that time I got 21. So last time I had 19, this time 21. So that's not bad at all. Like I said, I've got mystical, I've got the mystical fertilizer for days. I, I deliberately save it for an instance like this when I absolutely really, really need it. So let's go there. Let that finish plating up and come down here. That first batch should be full. And it is. Is that it? Another tank up there. So we're going to put four of you, one, two, three, four of you, one, two, three, four of you, grab all of you, and drop you in. Now, I am out of bronze, so before I can do more, I'm going to have to make bronze to do this here. Okay, so if I go to Draconic, I have one. To do more, I'm going to need, let me guess, the diamantine plates. are you doing? You're only at 11. Oh, that's not going to be enough. Oh, that's not good. What happened? because we're out of power. Great. Uh, you're restocking power. Yep, that's what was wrong. Oh my gosh. How are you doing? Two more finished. We have four. Excellent. Ah, that's bad. That's bad. That's bad. Oh my gosh. Where's my wrench? Laser wrench. Laser wrench. Good grief. Let's 
Okay, it's slowly starting to trickle in. Oh my gosh, I can't. I can't even. My pickaxe is a dangerous weapon. <laughs> it knocks out all the wrong things. Constantly knocking out all the wrong things. All right, let's bring fluid from there over to here. That's 11. And let me bring copper and tin down and make more bronze. Copper. Ten. Okay, I have enough for eleven. bronze is that oh yeah whole stack plus some that'll work so let's put the stack in there pull that out put that bronze away put the tin and the copper away I think I can put extra gold in here for now. Not a lot, but I'm going to take it just because I want to. I need to get going on this. Okay, so we have a little bit more. I'm going to put these up here. I have one from my boo boo. Pretty sure I don't have any in here. Not there. is what it is at this point. I thought 
thought we were going to work on energy upgrades, but we managed to find a little, little snippet of a source of blood to keep working on those Diamond Promise acceptors. So maybe we can actually get five of the eight done and then finish them up Saturday. I mean, that would be all right. I can see the bottom of the barrel if that's how empty it is. You're sure not going very fast, little dude. Don't one of these have... I had some of those speed items. Where did they go? Take what you can give me because that's too worth and I will be able to use that. I heard clattering. I thought I heard clattering. disappeared that fast. Why isn't my ring of Odin working? goes. For some reason I had to take it off and put it back on for it to start giving my, my bonus hearts. Which is really weird. Like, I want my bonus hearts! Damn it! <laughs> I need them very badly! Okay, 
that. Okay, so now I gotta set this up again here. So we've got this, 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 and these. there we're good that's draining bad <laughs> I think it's because this over here is just working full blast oh we did get another one I mean, it's slow, but it's getting there. So yeah, our problem is going to be we're not going to have, we're not going to have this because this is just crawling could bring the leaves from downstairs. That would give it a friend. I will let you live this time. I mean, you've got wood for days. I need, I need this to have, it's, it's one of those catch 22s I need both of them, both sources to have their stuff going at the same time. obviously has way more than it can use. What? No, I did it again. No, oh, maybe I didn't. Yeah, it's, I've got way more than I can use down here. So we'll bring some up here for you to use. Albeit, you'll use it slowly because you have no power. Steal some blood. Glad I came back for some other thing. We'll just take that. And we'll give you a jump start. Hopefully that helps. Maybe you're done. Okay. That's done. And we'll do that. Okay. So now I have the bronze done. 
keep rearranging things in my inventory like all the time. It's ridiculous. Uh, where's that? Get rid of that. Core. Two more. Okay, we need another diamond. Or the diamantine. We need like twenty thousand. Two and a half times nine be 18 like 22 5 we need like 22 5 to do one I'm probably better off letting that flow how are you doing nothing mm -hmm. You're moving, just not moving very fast. back in here again. I say we're stuck until we get like 25,000 life essence for the altar and then we can grab this and do another another thing. Let's look at What was I missing to make more of these? I have those. I have the transistors. I have the boosting mixture have plastic. Oh, more enchanted plate. Okay. okay so that's going to be oh, for goodness sakes. Gold. And glowstone ingots, which I have one. Okay, that is And I have one energetic blend. Oh, and all of my Osmian has been turned into plates. Hmm. Alright, we'll take that. That. And we'll turn half of them back into ingots. that. Okay. And 
this. Now, I always think it's in one machine and it's actually in the other. So there should be liquid. Oh, there's not liquid in either one of them. Act. Oh, that's right. I used the exact amount of liquid I had left to make bronze. Fortunately, this is full. But we're good. Back one first. This has to be a factor of three. So we'll do that and that. big number of that. We still have six. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Not a lot that it will get me going again on my, oh man, another friend. Kumadori calls her that, and now I can't stop calling her that. I'm going to put these. This, 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 this. I did not want to put the glowstone in there. Give me that back. I can put the sand in there and I can put the osmium back. There's one stack of eight. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, now I'm missing these. Ah, I still had some in storage from last from lunch hour. I can put those in there. Two, four. Now what am I missing? <laughs> now I'm missing the enchanted place again. And I might well have to. Alright, I managed to make 12. So let's go over to ore processing. And let's see how we're doing here. Now our 10 is all the way up to 71.50. I don't remember who all has what now. So you have the energy. You have the energy. 
I was mixing and matching so much last night that I just simply do not remember. Okay, you do not have the energy. You're pumping along fine without it. You look like you could use it. So who has like a partial energy? You don't have any yet. You don't have any yet. You don't have any yet. look like you're doing fine with energy. Ooh, we're low on sulfuric acid. Why are we low on sulfuric acid? You're getting energy. <laughs> Oxidizers processing them. You've got oxygen. What the heck happened here, guys? Moves up to fifteen six. And it ran out of such process again. Hopefully in three hours it's had a chance to get something here. Fourteen hundred, that's something. Let's see. Did I have? I can grab a little more gold the next time here. Okay. Uh, diamond. to now 94 
It's only 17 one. You can do it. Come on. You're at the 10. You're going to let copper beat you, gold. Copper is going to beat you. That's so sad. I suppose I should bring the ones from upstairs down here too so those get counted in. So that would be the 10 uh, copper. Sulfuric acid is going strong. Mine, not so much. Oh, you didn't get speed or anything yet. I need speed on you. How did I miss that? I somehow totally missed that. Um, we need to go get some speed upgrades on him. Let's see, speed is gold. Right. Let's go get those. That's probably why we're running out of sulfuric acid. Is we're missing some upgrades up here. Did you get your upgrades? You got the speed upgrades, but you didn't. kill the energy, but maybe that's going to help get the, maybe that'll eventually help the, I oh, know, yay. Crystals are still flowing. That's the important thing is we still have them flowing. quite everything I want out of it, but it's it's the best we're going to get at this moment. Okay, so warehouse, I need more enchanted plates, which means I need the gold. I need more of the glowstone. I need more of the gold. And I need more enchant, or more boosting mixture, which that's full again. Got it. Okay, we'll put a new one up there. Give 
another drink. And a bigger drink. So there's 16, so I can put that, and I can put 16 glowstone here. Why did it pause? It has power. Oh, did it run out of this? It did. Okay, I can do three more. This and one, two, three. Okay, that got me 64. Should probably go grab more boosting mixture. Turn too soon. It's over here. How are you doing? None yet. have any more of the I have enough for one more batch Why do I keep looking? I already grabbed them out of there. There's one pack of eight. Now I'm out of plastic. <laughs> oh, it's never ending with this game. Unfortunately, that was able to restock completely from lunch. That's right, this doesn't let me do that. It probably had filled up earlier and I should have taken care of that like first thing in the stream and I forgot. There are just too many moving pieces right now, really. So there's that. There's two. Now I'm missing these. Another batch of eight. No, 
other batch of eight. Now I'm out of boosting mixture. Oh no, wait, I brought boosting mixture. I brought a full stack of it up and it's all gone already. <laughs> You need energy. Oh, look at it go now. Let's get two of the washers there we're going now look at it Woo! <laughs> now we're flying Now we got to go make more. Need more gold. Put that back in there. And we need more boosting mixture. again. Okay, put another 16 in. Put the gold in. Put another 16 in. Yep, there is hype in the chat because we are, we have ores just, or little crystals just flying around the room. I forgot to get the, I forgot to pick up what I made. Uh, basement, I'm going to the basement. <laughs> Helps to pick up what I made. I got distracted by your hype, I was so happy. <laughs> oh goodness okay let's try this again uh i am actually running out of this again uh, here here I'm so glad I made all this peridot so I would be ready for these upgrades. <laughs> oh my goodness. Nighttime, we need to sleep. I am just so bouncy. need more of those. I need to take some redstone to get 
purified. Okay, so let's go over here. And excuse me, my bro, you thank you. We're going to do 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Steel. Pop out that steel. Grab a couple more of these. There's one batch of eight. take one two three four we are going to need more microchips now oy, 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 oy. what are you going to need to make another stack of microchips for me I already brought you boosting mixture I didn't bring you enough boosting mixture Ten, I need more red alloy ingots. Okay, red alloy ingots. Iron. This. boosting mixture okay boosting mixture and this now can I do 64 no. uh, okay 32 yay let me do 32 <laughs> I'll take it
I didn't see we're going to have to be Downside of having both of those in the same carpenter, you have to change the recipe back and forth. Okay, 32, and I can take my extra boosting mixtures back. No, I didn't mean to jump, I want to go up. Good grief. Okay. So now I have my boosting mixtures back, I bring more of these, and I bring more of these, and I bring more of these. thing at eight. Another set of eight. And I'm out of plates again. <laughs> again. Okay, but I need to get four more. So let's head back over to ore processing. Let's figure out who, let's say one of the washers. I think it's this one. You still needed one. Things should really start flying now. All three washers have them. You have one. You're at eight. Oh, you're only at four. Okay, you're getting four, so that'll top you off to max. Um, how about you? You're also at four, so we give you four. Okay, how about you? You need energy, we'll give you energy. All right, let's check. Okay, starting at the front of the line here. All right. Chemical oxidizer, it's running full blast. It is full. It has speed eight, energy eight. We're good. The next machine, okay, that was this one. This one is the chemical infuser. It is full. It has speed eight, energy eight. Okay, so the next machine is the rotary condensate, whatever, eight, eight. This one here, eight, eight. Distribution chamber, eight, eight, eight. Get, get up here. Washer one, speed, energy. Washer two, speed, energy. Washer three, speed, energy. Crystallizer one, Speed, energy. Crystallizer two. Speed, energy. Crystallizer three. Speed, energy. Okay, then we go down over here. The ones in the middle. Okay, 
You have speed, you have no energy. You're getting an energy. Okay, so I need one more. Where to put my pet? Pet. Okay, so the, there's one more chemical infuser who needs an energy, so I need eight more there. needs it so there's two Okay, we're almost done. We only need three more sets of energy and we are done with the upgrades on line three. We are almost done. That means we only need four. I can't even count how many. I'm not even going to try. So we need 24 more speed upgrades and we got this. We got this. What all did I did I knock the ceiling down again? Oh my god. <sighs> I hate when I do that. There you go. Alright. This time I can only do eight. Because I don't have a full tank. Okay, so I'll put this in there. I can only do eight. One, two, three. Eight. thing of those in. Another one of those in. Okay, so right now what I'm missing is the plates. Here we go. Plates. Two, four. Six. Hurry, come faster. Eight. Okay, home um, or processing. Okay, which one of these at the end didn't have one? Let's see. It's not you. It's you, okay. Okay, that takes care of the one at the end. Mm 
Now I'm out of plastic again. Oh, come on. This game, it hit me so. Okay, a couple little ones there. We can... Okay. Hopefully, this is going to be enough to get us enough dry rubber to finish this, maybe? Two, four. Now what am I missing? Now I'm missing the plates again. Plates. Weights. Six. Eight. Okay. Another one. Home or processing. It's these in the middle. In the middle. One's in the... Not you. Over here. You got yours. You did not. There's that. Oh my goodness, look at this. It's built up crystals fast. Okay, I have one, one left. Which one? It was the chemical infuser somewhere. Where was it? Forgot which one it was again. No. This one. Yes. Okay. So this was the last one that needs an energy upgrade, and then we will have all of the energy upgrades done. Okay, so we're going to go back down to the factory. We only have 15 of these left, so this is it. We do not have any more. I would have to make more glowstone ingots to do more, which I really do not want to do. I will at some point, because I'll need to put upgrades when I do line four, but... So I should need 15. Two, four, six. No, I'm out of boosting mixture. No. Oh, 
Oh, we may be saved. We may be saved. Found our last two. Two. And plates. And eight. Call more processing. And we're going to the this one here. Here, here. Line three is done. <laughs> Line three is completely done. We have all of the upgrades in. Everything is finished. Everything is now running at peak capacity. We are good to go. And oh, oh my goodness. Can you go faster? <laughs> The crystals are building up. My, my system is doing too good here. Holy cow! What's the difference between... <gasps> These are basic tubes. I mean, it shouldn't matter, though. Maybe tin just produces, or if tin just produces faster than gold? I'm glad I have an ultimate tin there because that thing's going to fill up really fast. Your energy is still not stable. Of course, you're the one that has, you're the higher energy one. And you're the third one on the system, so that could be the reason. Yeah, see, you're struggling and you're the third one, you're struggling more. Huh. <laughs> we need more power! We need more power, Captain! The only other option I have short term Hello, I wanted to stand up there. Oh for crying out loud. Get up there. I've got a bunch of these solar panel ones. 
I could probably I mean they don't they don't get up to anything worth mattering on a generation until they get up to like really like seven, six, seven. I mean, do I take, do I take some solar panels and work on getting more of them upgraded to add to my wyvern over there? So I end up with a a, a bigger solar network that can power that power cell. Because what I was doing before stopped working and now the power cell is not grabbing all the power like it did. Maybe it needs to be reset like my Odin ring. Oh, that's a good thought. Let me, let me do that. Do, 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 do. playing with different configurations. Okay, remember to shift when clicking so it retains the energy. And move this actually, let's put it over here. Well, that's more than it was getting before. Before it was only getting like 60. I wonder instead of doing that It's like it works for just a second and then it stops. I don't know why it's doing that.
I wonder if Something other than the infinite one would do better. All I have is the two signalians, though. Hmm. I mean, you would think it's infinite. I mean, wonder if I have to be like more clever with it or something. What if I did It says sunset, hurry up.
I don't understand why it's only accepting energy once from the solar panel where it wasn't before. It's just very confusing why it's not, before it was taking like all the energy from all the sides and it was just rolling with it and now it's not and I don't know why. I do, oh my gosh, that's just the <laughs> Now I'm guessing that's going to go down when the supply of sulfuric acid gets diverted to site four is what I'm guessing is going to happen. Because neither of those stockpile like that. It's very strange. Okay, well, that has enough to at least stabilize there. Now the brine can't keep up. We knew that, though, because we figured one of the next steps was going to have to be increasing the height of the towers back up to full. Although we are chugging along at a good clip. Almost 8,000. That's almost 16. That only needs another 1,000 and the gold is going to have another one done. I just need to, I just need to keep gold, if I can keep gold going overnight, We should have the second gold extreme singularity done tomorrow. And then what I can do is I can swap gold out for lead. Let lead do its three singularities. And now we'll let, the, let my gold supply restock to do the third one is what I think I'm going to do.
So we only need another thousand to finish. Oh, let me put put these extra things away. Now that we've got we've got that done. Put this, 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 this. Uh, this, 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 this. And store that in there for next time because you know there's going to be a next time on those upgrades. Um, let's see how we're doing on our diamond promise acceptors. None are done yet. Oh, we do, however, have progress here. one out and around here and we're gonna do one two three let me go up and grab my glowstone oh let's just grab it all do, 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 second to clear some room. I think we may be able to get one more done before the end of the stream. I think. We need three more draconic cores. If we can finish three more draconic cores, we have the diamond promise acceptors to make one more wyvern. Okay, we're gonna need more of those plates. That time I took the turn too soon. Good grief. Okay. We're going to do one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Why that is still good too. Okay, boom, boom, and where is it? There it is, boom. So you're good on that. Oh, sunset, sleep, need to sleep. I want to sleep. <laughs> Thank you. All right, here we go.
I think I can speed up the rate that this will fill via pipe with more of the displacement rooms. It might be worth adding some more of those to speed up the fill rate. Another one's finished yet. too many things. Far too many things. Okay, how many of those? Oh, I only have two diamonds. Okay, I'm not going to be able to get three. I think I'm going to have to do two more rounds of the diamantine to finish three draconic cores, I think. I believe there's supposed to be a way where you can automatically fill this with blood using spawners, and I have extra pig spawners. So I wonder if I could maybe set up two of those pig spawners in the space underneath here and use pig spawners as opposed to monster spawners. I don't want to use monster spawners because one of those named mobs can get loose in my base and just wreak havoc. I'm like, yeah, no, don't want that. <laughs> we will forever remember the ninja wither that got loose from the uh, wither cage and wreaked havoc on District Spark's base. Nope, 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 nope. And nobody got time for that. Especially me. I'm going to go and drop that off in there because goodness knows I need some space. Ugh. There's enough in there to do the next one too, so that's good. It's just a matter of letting it fill the fill the basin and we'll be right as rain. Okay, so there's that. So now I need to bring these things around. So here is that, 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 and where is it? There it is there. Okay, good. It's really weird. This this used to be plenty of power to keep everything happy, and now lately it is not. 
I might have to bring one of the dynamos down or something to kickstart the power down here. That's the roof. And I still haven't figured out what took out the door of my reactor. I'm a little worried. <laughs> strikes me as really, really weird. Oh, Nutty Boy, thank you very much for the follow. I just now noticed that. Very glad to have you. Okay, Draconic. There's one. What am I missing? More plates. Okay, let's see how we've we've stayed away for a little while. Okay, we stayed away for a while and got 16 from our essence, so that's, that's good. Let me get number five, and then we're missing one plate, Ugh, one diamantine plate, because of course we are. Okay, so let me move this out of the way. have enough to do one more. It's just a matter of, of letting it run through here. And we've already accomplished one of our goals for tonight because the tin line is now completely upgraded and um, has all of its, its, everything's going. So, one of our two goals is accomplished for the night. So that is very, very awesome. And 
And if we get the majority of the other one done tonight, we will definitely be able to finish it this weekend because it's going to give me like two days to accumulate all the resources I need to finish the last three crafts during our stream on Saturday. So, very, very excited about that. I was hoping I'd get it done tonight, but I didn't know about those Diamond Promise acceptors. <laughs> I, I, I should say, I knew about them. I just forgot I knew about them until I remembered about them. Eh, yeah. Yeah, I definitely, I'm going to have to basically just basically leave diamonds sitting in there, like all the time, to start building up a stockpile of diamond promise acceptors. But I also have got to figure out the power situation over there, because by having that thing run continuously to make blood for the blood infuser to make diamond promise acceptors, there's no power. There's completely and absolutely no power. The water wheel is just not cutting it. So, yet again, another area that needs power. Ugh. I know this should be should be cured when I can get the reactor up and running and keep it running, but the key part of that is and keep it running. <laughs> Until I can do that part, having the reactor doesn't help. Okay, there's that part. We're getting real close to a point, though, where the ore processing is going to have all the lines I need completed, and it's just going to be a matter of letting the ore run through. And then I will be able to focus on that infrastructure issue over at the reactor. And once I have that solved to where I have a constant source of that solar-generated uh, fuel coming in, that should keep the reactor going at the lowest level, I hope. Again, it's a big I hope. very frustrating. I have this great tool there, and I just don't have the infrastructure to be able to use it. Make sure I've got all my lava. See, the other thing is I'm going to have to make some empowered emeraldic because the last of what I have is going to get used on this wyvern core. So if we get enough, we'll have enough to make one more wyvern core, and then we're going to need some other resources to keep going anyway. So, how are you doing? Oh, oh, we have enough to make one more! <laughs> there is power getting down here then, because this is generating resources for the infuser. So, there is some power. What are you out of? See, you're out of, out of, I, 
I don't know what I'm going to do here about power down here. I do have some dynamos. Like those, that goes in. I, I don't know if I necessarily want you to have all of them. You can have a couple of them. You have two of them. I'll let you have three of them because I'm using you more because you're, make, you're making my sin gas. Generates energy, requires fluid, fuel, and a coolant. Steam dynamo only requires water and a solid fuel. Yeah, I'm not going to burn up my currency, thank you anyway. Now there's the culinary generator that burns food, but I kind of want my food. I mean, that's not to say we couldn't, you know, plant something that would, hmm, now that's a thought. Six. And here's our wyvern core. We have the stuff to do another craft. Let's go do another craft. Why, yes. Yes, we should. Do, 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 do. We should start upgrading the other side. Okay, there's one of you. There's two of you. Oh, wait, I'm missing the block. Hang on one sec. I need the block of draconium. I forgot about that. How are you guys doing up here? Uh, let's see, your tin, you can go downstairs. Your copper, you can go downstairs. Uh, sounds like we'll have to fertilize a little more. That, that's okay, we can do that. Okay, let's give you some more. Tin's already up to 8,000. <laughs> 
Coppers up to 10 9. Like exactly a thousand to go for gold to have one finished. Come on, gold, you got this. Come on. Okay, home basement. Grab two stacks of this. Okay, three stacks. I don't care. That's fine. Here we go. Do it again. Yep, I forgot the block. <laughs> I was so focused on getting the cores, I forgot about the draconian block. I needed nine and I got ten. Ha, worked out perfect. Block please. Thank you, and we will very carefully break you, and we'll put you in its place, put one there. Oh my goodness. <laughs> there is, is 3,500 crystals and growing. To, we've got to fix Mr. Hydrogen Chloride over here because it's it's not a it's not doing well. It's funny because this tower is. This tower is 11. They're both very similar.
They both have speed and energy upgrades. to be sunset time to shut everything down <coughs> excuse me I think what I can do is I have oh it's already down there actually hang on Let's take that, that, that. No, don't put another hole in the floor. Really? Oh, it's only a basic bin. Hang on. I need... doing that one was there for a reason silly that's not going to work that way that's fine we can do it this way uh where is that Oh, 
copper needs to feed into this here. Oh, the coal generator does not burn blocks of coal. Why is the coal generator not burning coal? How am I going to do this? Oh, I guess I'll just have to do this. I have like, feels like infinite amounts of coal. So I could just let that coal generator just run and power that area. I don't think that would be an issue. It probably won't keep it running overnight, but it'll, I think, I think that'll probably be just as easy as anything. All right, let me unload again. And we will call that a night. We got five. Oh, dang it. Fine. I was trying to be all organized with it. I'll just load it up then. We did pretty amazing getting five of the eight. I know. I mean, this is getting ridiculous. The ten. <laughs> the ten. This is going nuts. This this can't 
keep up, which is why it gets backlogged over here. And it's because, I think, because this is not producing enough brine. Although, this one is producing only slightly more with a height of 13. So I'm hoping if I increase the height of this too, that will stabilize it enough for it to be okay. Because this one's running on a height of 13 and it's stable. So this is stable at a height of 13. This one is unstable at a height of 11. And because it's unstable, this is allowing to accumulate. So I think one last improvement before tin can be considered done is tower two needs to go up two more levels so that it's at least equal to, um, to tower one. Or before I had it, you know, it was 18 and five, I think, or whatever it was. And we basically shrunk tower one down to the minimum it can to be functional so that we could raise tower two without me having to uh, spend, you know, spend a whole bunch of time building it up. And so we, got, we, we shrunk it from 18, 18 down to five. So we moved five levels of height from tower one to tower two. So it must have been six. It looks like it needs at least two more levels. So it looks like for my setup, a height of 13 is the minimum needed for a stable processing here. So it looks like that's something I can do tomorrow maybe during um, district stream is add two more levels to tower two and see if that helps things, which fortunately this is an ultimate bin. So if this is gonna keep ratcheting up, eh, there's room there. So we got 8371, 16-1, almost 16-2, almost 11. I'm telling you, copper's gonna catch you gold. Copper's gonna catch you. I, 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 I legit think copper is going to, wait, 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 wait. The satchel has a gooey? Whoa, 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 whoa. Configure which items this satchel can automatically pick up? What? Katiana did not know this was an option. Tatiana is pleased by this. All right, let me let me go restock gold one more time. I know I'll wake up in the middle of the night and I'm gonna like gold's run out. I have to go check on it. <laughs> that gold line it just worries me so. wyvern things upgraded tonight that's amazingly good progress considering we needed all those diamond promise acceptors to be able to have done five of the eight is pretty darn awesome so hopefully we can get I will run like a whole bunch of the coal ore, where is it? 
Yeah, I have almost 200,000 coal ore. I think we can do a coal generator for over there. Just a hunch. We'll just we'll just pulverize that coal ore. And oh, uh, let's see. Let's just put that over here for now. And I need to put this away. And that. So yeah, we got five of the eight done in our. Oh, we got another one. Boom. Five of the eight done in our wyvern upgrade on our, fish, our fission crafting, which is pretty awesome. We got all of the upgrades put in for our tin line. So then now the next thing we really need is the thermal, that's not right, thermal, what are those, those towers called? Thermal, oh wait, I have them right here. Thermal evaporation block. Did I have any in here? No. Do I have any around here? One L. Well, oh, that'll be fine. I thought I had a little bit left over. That's a thermal lily. Really. Thermal Expansion Exchanger Core. Maybe they're in the power. some blocks left over but I am not seeing them now which is kind of odd yeah I don't know what before the setup I had this thing would go all the way up to 1.6 and now it's it's not and I don't know why I didn't change anything before and and now it's it's just not it's not doing the same thing it was I don't know. I'm very, very confused. Huh. Oh, maybe it's in here. I thought for sure I had some more of that already. Ah, I do. There it is. I have three. Which isn't a lot, I know, but... Whoa! Diamond is almost to 10,000. We're going to get our diamond singularity tomorrow. Cause that's 6,100. That's 
61, 15, that's 16,000. We need 17 once. So we need a thousand, basically need a thousand more diamond blocks. That pickaxe is still in good shape. That one's in really, really good shape. Oh, you know what? I'm an idiot. This is pickaxe number two, and this is pickaxe number three. Switch a Rooney. Let pickaxe number three sit idle. Wait, 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 wait. There's speed upgrades in the users. Wait, 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 wait. Home, 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 home. already pretty fast anyway, but doesn't work in the user with this. Darn it. Well, it was worth experimenting with. Hopefully have plenty of coal. It's processing, so I'll take it. So it it's working, so we will we will take that and and call that good. So being bouncy. That, that hopefully will keep both this generating life essence and that generating blood for a while. And then I can, ref I can refresh the coal supply again a couple of times a day. Advantage of working at home. Uh, 
It may not be, you know, a lot of power, but at least it's some power. Okay, so it looks like we have one more thing we'll need to do for, for 10 is get that tower up two more levels. And then hopefully that will stabilize uh, and so it can catch up on the crystals. And then we can work on tier 4. And we have three more, three more uh, upgrades of these to do. So that will be great. So I may stream... Tomorrow, after District Spark is done with his, I may not. We'll just have to see um, see what goes. Um, Akumadori has to babysit her sister, so she won't be here until Saturday. And it is her birthday weekend, so we're going to be off doing some things on Saturday afternoon. Though our stream may start a smidge later than normal. Um, until we, you know, until we get back from those, those, uh, shenanigans, as District would say. Um, but we will definitely be streaming. Don't worry about that. Um, because, uh, we've got to finish this upgrade, see what that Dragonheart quest is all about. And then she will come and get all the, caught up on all the turn-ins, and that will give me the second quadruple battery I need so that I can make the energy core and explore this storage device battery thing that's draconic in nature so we this could be a very exciting weekend of uh, some more developments and of course always working on our ores always working on these extreme singularities and attempting to get the infinity catalyst so after five hours hope you guys enjoyed it if you like what you see please hit the follow button like nutty did and join the little group uh, I will be uploading tonight's episode to YouTube where the entire archive can be found under Katiana Swift Arrow. Thank you, Deaths. Glad you could lurk tonight. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, so much fun doing that draconic crafting. I, I really do enjoy all the animations and stuff. That is quite, quite fun. And very soon we will be taking the next step towards our awakened draconium and our seeds. So I've got a lot, I've got a lot of prep work to do because a reminder that that is going to evolve, where is it, where's my awakening, no not that, that involves this craft, so I've got these that I've already made, Draconic cores, adamant blocks, dragon hearts, empowered diamantine, majestic block, but it means more ancient blocks. So a lot of ancient dust is going to have to be made so that I can do this craft multiple times. And then this energy cost. Oh my god, this energy cost. So, yeah, that's a thing. So, like I said, when we get to the point we are ready to do this craft, meaning I actually have all the components on all the sides and everything, because I, I'm going to have to get the extreme singularity going. When I actually have this, oh, you know, I just, that's actually a really good, I, I just, I literally just this like instant thought of that. I should get the experience seeds going in that empty cloche. Oh, I'm so glad I looked at that recipe. The cloche where nickel was, we're going to convert that to experience. Do I have any of this bone meal left? No. Oh, wait. Let me look if I have any in the basement. I'm going to need a 2500 of the solidified experience to make um, to 
to make exp uh, experience singularities. Just the regular kind with 2500, not the crazy kind of like these blocks like I'm doing now. So if we can use this cloche up here, okay, so that Check mark that. Then I think we can just take that off and it'll stop here, right? But we want it to go into this. So we have now converted this to an experience collector and that will start us on the process of building towards that experience singularity we're going to need. Oh, I'm so glad I looked at that. Oh, yo, 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 yo. I have some here as well. Why did I have Triberium? Oh, that's right. I turned that liquid Triberium into... I was converting my liquid essence cells into solidified experience. And I had a whole bunch of Triberium ingots. Or I had liquefied... I had liquefied Triberium and I went ahead and turned it over or converted it into ingots. Okay. Let's try this again. <laughs> All right. So, I'm going to increase the height of the tower two levels so that it matches tower one. I'm going to try and get the start of line four started working the other direction so I'm generating crystals and I'm going to build up the resources so that we can try and do the last three upgrades to our wyvern in to in wyvern infusers during Saturday's stream so that is the stuff I'll be working on probably during district stream tomorrow night and Maybe I'll stream tomorrow afterwards. We'll see how tired I am. Otherwise, I will see you guys on Saturday afternoon when Akumadoria is here. And we will have our normal Saturday afternoon and evening hijinks together. So, I'm Katiana. This has been Dungeons, Dragons, and Space Shuttles. Thank you, everybody, for watching tonight. Thank you, Deaths. Hope you have a good evening at work. And we will see you this weekend. Everybody stay safe. Take care, and I'll see you next time. Good night, everybody.